So P cards or PGT and BTC4 and Porsche classes. How many cars we exactly have? It's difficult to say as it stands, but Inga will be on the grid within a few seconds, and then we will show you what is certain. Arthur's Batrax, who was the winner of first race, set the fastest lap there as well, and it means that he will start from the pole position once again. But uh, over to Inga now. And we are back on the grid. Check it out. No changes there. As he started from the pole position during qualifying, started the race from first one position. I mean, we can ask about plans uh, here, second position on the grid, according to the lap times. I get this Grajis waited for the race. What's the plan there? What's the plan? Plan to be consistent and, uh, and win. <laughs> Some guys were looking for battles, you know, for fights. I guess you're looking for clean ride? I guess so, because uh, the Lambo GT3 for sure is a much uh, more faster car, so so we'll see. I, I hope, yeah, I, I'm hoping for a clean uh, race, yeah. Okay, good luck. Thank you. Uh, so, as I mentioned, Lamborghinis, right? Porsche here, Porsche there, another Lamborghini and Mercedes moved from the back of the grid. He's already see, starting from which it is position one, two, three, four, five. So much better position for them to start. And of course, they are motivated to reach the best result. I guess I don't need to ask about the motivation, right? <laughs> yeah, of course. <laughs> best of luck for you. Nice looking car. Mm. Some more Porsche here and Keblis. And oh, we can quickly try to check how the window looks now of the Copra before leaving the track. Like new, brand new. Amazing. Egidio is waving to us and look at that. Look at that. Amazing. New window. Right, back to you, Thomas. Yes, good news, because the uh, front side window of that uh, Seat or Cupra number 15 was uh, shattered before race one, and they, the team searched for the replacement, and they actually found one, but uh, couldn't uh, get it in time for race one, so they had... Uh, the window taped all together. Tape was the one, was the thing which was keeping it together. Car was allowed on the track and uh, did more or less okay, unless the fact that uh, number 15 collided with number 95 Volkswagen, which meant that uh, the damage done was such uh, extensive. Uh, that number 95 is out for today, so that car is not going to start here and now, nor will it uh, start in Nankang two hour race, which is extremely bad news because they should have started from P2 there. But these nice Porsches, Lambos. Mercedes, BMW, a lot of TCR cars. Good so looking cars. Amazing oh. looking cars, right? The best grid. And actually the fastest one as well. Yes. Happens to be. It's the old proverb that the car which uh, looks fine is usually very quick. Yeah. <laughs> it is nothing like it. And they also will have uh, two laps before the rolling start will yeah. be given. The warm up and formation. formation. Traditionally. Mm, yep. Yeah. And um, as we could hear from Egidius Grajis, 
He's not uh, trying to fight uh, no, Artur no, Batrak. No. I already saw that in his face. That yeah, he, no, he's, no. He, he's planning to go smoothly, keeping the car safe and keeping yeah, himself it's safe. Like like uh, old Estonian proverb says, you can't uh, jump over your shadow. Yeah, yeah. So he knows exactly where he stands. Uh, yeah. He stands in front of everybody else. As actually, yeah, Batrak. it's obvious in your in your in his face and his eyes and his look. Uh, I mean. No, no jumping, uh, jumping something, you know, it's like calmly preparing. Looking at the best times, win. best lap times from race one, Batrak's best was 118.5 and Grajis in second 120.1, so yeah. 1.6 seconds. That's a yeah. very, very clear, uh, very clear gap. And, and quite a gap between him and his... Uh, Made uh, Totvidas Rudokas. Yes, and uh, if we look the gap Both between Rajis and Rudokas, so it's it's two two tenths. So yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So quite safe position. That's why, of course, needed to finish line should be crossed, uh, driving calmly and saving uh, energy, car, yeah. resources. So the warm up lap is completed. Now the cars are on the formation lap. Of course, no sign of uh, formation yet. No, uh, we're no. taking the last third of the track. Duty to the tires now. Duty to the tires. Yeah. And what was uh, Agudius Geluna's uh, lap time? Uh, the best one during the. Geluna's 127.6. Oh, because he was penalized with the three positions in the starting grid. Yeah. As well, some second worded. So. so he should have been in. Yeah, he should have been in ninth and he's in 12th probably. Yeah. Okay. Because, yeah, he took uh, off number 95. Volkswagen yeah. uh, and uh, yeah, damage was terminated for today. Sad, minus one car in two, two hour race as well. Yeah. But still, uh, as I just checked, it's towards 70 grid, we have then 20 teams. Still decent grid, yeah. Now, here is your formation, forming. Our trucks and garages were side by side already. Okay, no oh nice. And here they go through the penultimate turn. But I would think that uh, Kilunas number 15 is still starting from 9th as is printed on the grid. Anyway, here we go. Race 2 for GTs. And the flag in light. Seems everything quite smooth. Bartrax already taking his position and driving away. Yeah, but who's going to be second? Looks like Skrashis. Yes. Yeah, still. So that's what he was talking about. And Mercedes. Uh, Carolista Sukinas is now in fourth already. And Ooh. this is Ivaras Remeka. Uh, no, it's not. Yeah, still it is. Okay. This car is missing uh, the what back did we end. Miss? What body, did we miss? panel. That was probably some, some rear ending, which was. Was this? Did someone hit him? Yeah, probably. Checking the fronts of the cars now. Yeah, who was trying to number, find number 44? Set was behind him. That was one car. And I think one of Porsches as well. But they are both out of sight now. I can tell you what was the cause of that damage. 14 laps is the distance of the race, and we clearly see that Arthur Patrax has already pulled away yeah, from he's doing what he knows all the others. Best. Okay, so who hit him? 
maybe we, we will know. And that is interesting picture. Jürgen Jönkar in his BMW challenging Korolistas Tsukinos in that Mercedes AMG. Okay, he's not challenging. He was just <laughs> he, he was just close to him. Yeah, it he was is, close to be honest. To him. But they stay close. They stay okay. close. There are some liquids, I guess, on the track. Yeah, um, it may be not liquid. Uh, I clean. think it's body parts from Rebecca's yeah, car. Yeah, could be. Which place is it? Uh, cinema turn. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's some the kind hot. of hose. Yeah. Yeah, and Remika is moving very slowly. Still no information what happened. Now cars are spread across the track quite evenly. Yeah. According gap, to their pace, the yeah, gap, gaps are already rather large but what we can talk about uh, leaders they have last been lap of Arthur's Bartrox was 122.7 and Egidius Grazi's lap time was better yeah, 122.0 yeah but the, those flats were out yep, there yep. so Bartrox the has the first in the same, the same second as well yeah. so. because Bartrox has uh, he was arriving there first and of course he didn't know what, yep. what to expect what, what to wait, yeah, what to yeah. see, what to find Yeah, that's nice, nice looking car. But Amazing. <laughs> even better is the sound. You, yeah, you, it's undescribable. Different. You yeah. can, you can uh, differ. Yeah, when Porsche, sure. Lamborghini, and this one beast. Yeah, be ghost. yeah. It's large displacement without turbos, mm -hmm. so it's on the main straight. If it, it passes by, it's like it like an earthquake. Amazing. Meanwhile, yeah. 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 is. Completing his third lap now, a little bit faster, uh, but still in 120s only. Yeah, but on the other hand, no, no, no need to push at all. Because Maybe he doesn't want to feel lonely, he wants to have someone yeah, around. Yeah, yeah. Like yeah having, having two Porsches in company, it's a good yeah, company nice, for sure. Yeah, nice looking cars, why not? <laughs> And especially if you are in front of them, it exactly. looks even better. You're followed by two nice looking yeah. Porsches. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? And here we see what the gap really is. Not that large, but exactly. uh, for those in back, it's uh, impossible to catch. The pace difference is obvious yeah. as uh, as Tautvidas Rodokas 121 uh, already is going one second slower than Grajiso Bartrox and Carlos Tasukinas the best lap time uh, 125 and the last one 126 and the rest of the guys going even slower so you can imagine that the gap is go growing faster and faster So what is Bartrox time in this? 120.1 Yeah Good, but not exceptional. What? Where to push? Where to push? So here. And here we go. And Jorgi Ankari in that number 47 BMW is a leader of PTTM class. Yes. yes, yes, yes. With number. 53 Rokas Kvyadaras. At this point, just behind him. Karolis Tasukinas now is this, uh, has the second so position. So, can you see some damage on the front end of those cars? Seems no. Seems healthy. Yeah. Full. Or maybe he had But there's the another TCR, right? There's the Egidius Galunas. Yeah, number 15. We didn't see him after that collision. I mean, some that. We, did, like, we don't say that he did that, yeah, but, but we don't say also that he didn't. He was in front of Rebecca at the start, so it's uh, not impossible, but uh, it's unlikely that he hit him. Anyway, that's not a big problem. Rebecca is out. 
whatever the reason. Maybe maybe he s simply spun somewhere there in, in, in the cinema turn, we don't know. This time around, Batrax was a little bit slower than on the previous lap, but still the gap to Gigidus yeah. is he, growing. I'm sure he's checking in the mirror to see where are they, yeah. and accordingly keeps the pace. And here it becomes interesting because Lucas Laukaitis has caught Lucas Kedutis. One make uh, series cars both. Porsche Carrera Cup car and the Lamborghini Super Lamborghini. Trofeo. Oh, some parts in the ground. Or was that cone? Maybe that was cone. I don't think it's put back. I think it's Grazis drives is the best lap of today's race, the second run at least, 120.8. So this pair is actually the only one, uh, not only one. No. Here is another pair which is battling between themselves. Number 44, Hendrik Kostatkus, and number 4, Darius Kocius. Another duo. Meanwhile, Botrox completed his sixth lap, and uh, yeah, he's now taking it very easy. 120.5. Not over pushing. Absolutely no, no not, not even close to it. He's. Uh, I, first I'm race sure. I'm sure if he would be able to check what's going on in his car, he would be like. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. I don't think so. <laughs> calmly, you know. Yeah, exactly. Calmly. You must. You must stay, <laughs> especially on this track. You must stay concentrated. Yes. 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 We, s we saw actually, d do you remember, we saw during the final lap uh, in race one uh, how he had the moment yeah. uh, at, at the hospital yeah. turn. The final corner. Yeah, just out of nothing. Because he relaxed early. We don't know. Oh, here it becomes also Piadras interesting because, also. Yeah, because Rokas Piadras has caught, Jurgi Jönkari almost has caught and they are first and second and in their class. BGTM, yes. And how good looking that Porsche is! Amazing. Yeah, black and black and gold, and like gold. Uh, like old, old, yeah, <laughs> yeah. as it is. As yeah, it is. classic 70s, uh, 1970s Lotus uh, JPS cars yeah. were, were had this uh, scheme, and Ayrton Senna's Lotus in '85 was exactly the same. So yeah. Once again, Agidius Grajis drives his best lap time, 120.2. But Patrax is dropping his pace. Yeah. Not over pushing at all. Oh, no, no, no. Rajis was almost a second faster than him. But it, in, in the peak picture, it doesn't make any difference. I suspect uh, Junkeri may have uh, some issue with his car. Maybe some, I don't know, brake or... Yeah, you saw. Yes. That was uh, black smoke from yes. brakes. We'll it, try to it, catch it, him it, it may later be on his in the park for a minute to ask. Yeah, it may be his problem. But again, one thing is to catch your rival, completely different is to overtake him. There was also some red and yellow striped flag, some something on the track probably, some debris. Close enough. It's close enough. Aha, here is a swap of positions happened as well. Gochus, yeah. and They're going third to be lapped by the leader. He's in 120s again. Okay, blue flags. Mind, mind flags. Flashing the lights. Yeah. It's very, uh, actually, it's a very, very uncomfortable situation for both drivers in, in this section of the track when. You, you have to overtake. Mm-hmm, exactly. Especially if you can't, can't uh, know what the driver in front of you is going to do. <laughs> Does he see you? No, he, 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 even, he, even if he sees, because that is, it, track, is, track is not straight yeah. there. This is how and left, when right, and left, right, left, right, all the time. And, and to, uh, 
just the, the select the, the right moment, it will be difficult. Smoking. Yeah, but now they are safely by. Lucas Lopait is in the fifth position here. Yeah, we, we didn't see how he overtook Kedulit, Kedulis, but somehow he has done it. And that battle be between number 4 and 44 is not over yet. Mm, he just had quite poor, poor exit from the final turn and it uh, meant that Stankus was on his rear bumper instantly. But that's it. And Patrax safe, lost safe gap here. Yeah, Patrax lost about one and a half seconds waiting for slower cars to uh, to overtake them. That's the thing about yeah, but the mixture of the slow the slower cars and faster cars. But that's not a problem because he no. he those Porsches lost almost exactly the same amount of time. That's racing. Part actually, actually. Who set the fastest lap of the race? Don't we the Rudokas? Really? Really? 120.127. It's Don't just... Don't we the best one? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, until this man, number 69, Arthur Batrax, is cruising. Another people... Ah, uh, Batrax now takes, takes the fastest lap. No, he didn't. He's shown, he's shown his violet background should mean that he has the fastest lap, but actually he hasn't. Anyway, he's leading the race by about three seconds, which basically is a huge enjoying. gap. Enjoying, he's just enjoying, riding and enjoying. Or maybe struggling, you never know. I would try to ask him. Safe, safe. Yeah, yeah Rudoka is showing quite a pace. He's trying to overtake against Regis. And by the way, Laukait is in fifth. He's catching Stasiupinos in fourth. They were separated yeah. by less than a uh, second on the line. So we'll, one can expect. Kvadra is still trying to catch Jurki Angari. Some uh, positions changed there. laps to go. This time now, Artur Bartrax, 1 minute 19.8. So, so finally he is in 119s. Thank and you, no Artur. And no change here. No, I'm still trying to catch it. Yeah, Jankar is still in front and Fyodor is still Closing following in him. Following him, but yeah. Something is going to yeah, happen yeah, here. He has, yeah, Jankar is certainly has problem Something with this brakes. Something is happening here. Again, some it's some yeah, some smoke. It, it's it's not keep even. It, keep it. It's not. I think it's not even smoke, but it's more like a, like a dust. Or I don't know what what material he is. Is it is it carbon or what? But Ooh, black dust is is like. More and more he's struggling to stop his car. Yeah, Rokas Gadra sees that. Yeah, yeah. He sees that. I I would think it's just a matter of time when. Ooh these positions will be swapped. Junker is faster down the straights, but he can't use the, his speed because he can't stop. Yeah. Three laps to go, right? Yeah. And here we and go. he's trying, yeah. Okay, under to under acceleration, this BMW certainly has yeah, more. Yeah, but then when he, he gets uh, his, the brake, yeah, yeah, you can see that's unstable. He certainly has more horsepower and can pull away a little bit down the straight, but next turn hospital will be critical. And there are two more laps actually, one yes. and a half laps. So 
It will be very, very difficult for your gear yeah. carrier to hold on. Up until the ah, end. fortunately for him, Luciada has made a mistake, but it was just a tiny one. And this is oh, leader. Look who's behind <laughs> those two? On the other hand, for opportunities. yeah, the other must be, must be, he can't risk actually. Yes. He can't risk. If, if opportunity He's looking for that one chance, for that one yeah. chance. He might use the opportunity as the Bartraks now so overlapping final. us, uh, all of these guys and this battle. So maybe, maybe he will manage to use this opportunity as these guys should allow him go. Yeah, they are shown mm -hmm. already mm -hmm. blue flags, so no, no questions. They must, yeah, they must, must allow him past. Again, in the very, okay. very uh, uncomfortable section. And you see, yeah, yeah, he tried, what he tried yeah. to use the situation <laughs> with yeah, the bottom. But I, I, no. I think, I think Yankari saw it coming, but now they are side yeah, by side. Side by side. Although Yankari is on the inside, and but I think he will lose Kladres, out. Kladres. No, backing up, no, he's trying to keep the position. Yankari did it oh, very wisely, wow. he was slowing uh, another Porsche, they must let Over these Porsche away. Yes, yeah. another situation for these guys. Yeah. But I think Yadaras now thinks it's all over. Looks like, looks like he's not pushing anymore. And yes, Junker is here. He's safe now, I would say. And yeah, Porsche. And this is the winner. Yeah, crossing, I guess, the finish line. Flashing the lights already. Congratulations, Arturs. As always, amazing. Arturs Botrox brings his Lamborghini Huracan GT3. Second position in BG, uh, BGT Pro, taken by Carlos Tasukinas with Mercedes Benz. For some serious and important points taken into the uh, and account, and um, Lauquaitis, uh, Lauquaitis was just a second behind him. Yeah, 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 yes. If, if, I think few more laps would clear yeah, how it could it's be. It's very, very difficult to overtake with yes. those cars here on, on this track because so basically. So Gidus Grajis kept the first place in Porsche 992. Jurke Jonkari, nice. BGT AM. I will try to talk to this guy now, trying to get more information about the brakes. See you from or Park what, what, Ferme. Whatever happened. Yeah. And here we can see the winner with amazing Lamborghini, Arturs Bartrax, as promised, as he started from the pole position, pole position second time, pole position third time, fully pole position without penalties, without crashes, going, going the pace, and sometimes it seemed like he was waiting for other guys to catch him up. So well done, all three guys here. BGT Pro leader and 
Well done! Woo, 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 woo. Amazing! Amazing! Yeah, let's wait for him to take off the helmet. Arts, come on! That's a comeback! That's kind of comeback, yeah. right? That I was, guess. But it was waiting all time. <laughs> Actually, you could feel that because I thought I thought one time that if we would be able to get into the car, we would hear like, mm, 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 you know, no, the face, enjoying, the enjoying, enjoying, home track, friends, family, everyone. Well done, congratulations! Thank you. Fully pack of pole positions. Yeah. Well done. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And where is? I came to see you. Thank you, thank you. No What's going on? English, but small speak English. Small? small okay. Small speak, yes. What happened? Why is so yeah, slippery? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, maybe in oil street. Oh. I understand. I don't know. We thought maybe you had issues with brakes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> brakes were okay? Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay so as you can see, a lot of tire marks here, some damage with the Peugeot, so maybe that's the car who hit it, as we were trying to find during the stream. Some gutted corners here. And the beautiful Mercedes here, did the best as you could. Let's try to get a quick word. So how about the result? Are you satisfied? <laughs> of course I'm satisfied. It was easy because yesterday was so bad that today was very easy to improve. <laughs> yeah, so actually now you took you took the second uh, place in BGT Pro uh, during this uh, run. Second run is uh, your second. So a lot of important points goes to your account. So that's good. Yeah, and of course good practice. <laughs> most important thing that this can be... Very nice for my wife. <laughs> we we men all, all everything do just for, for women. Wives? Yeah, just. <laughs> well, actually, you, your performance looked good. We are happy. Thank you. <laughs> well done. Thank you. Okay, so now I guess as the, these big guys already parked here safely, you know what's next: the BMWs, the animals on the grid. Let's go. <laughs> 